What's up guys, welcome back to No Man's Sky. I'm not going to mess around in this one, no building or anything, or as far as I know at the moment. I'm just going to get on with a mission. I want to try and get through um, as much of the missions and that as I can. I want to try and get to the um, get some more systems and get the uh, freighter, is it? The, you know, the big capital type ship. Yeah, I want to be able to do stuff with the other guys on the, on the server that I'm on, or the world that I'm on. Um, but I want to get further through the mission and stuff first, and, and learn new things, and um, yeah, get a better idea about what's going on. So, got another uh, message coming through from where we left off last time. Where is there anyone out there? It's outside. It something's wrong with identify yourself. It's how the strange that I can hear him. There's a moment's pause. The only sound I hear is the background hiss of cosmic radiation. You you found me. There's so little light. I thought I'd never hear another soul again. I really did. Oh, is this Artemis? Oh, it is. Did it say it at the top and I just noticed? I don't know. I'll have to check that back. How did you find my voice? Say so you found a crashed ship. I told a stranger about the abandoned starship, Breck, uh, and how I found their communicator ID in the distress beacon. I begin to mention the anomalous space station, but they cut me off. It's outside, but I think I'm safe. There are 16 of them. They look like... Um, ask where they are. Ask about the 16. Oh, where are you? Yeah. Fears and confusion dance within the eyes of the stranger. After a few moments of silence, they turn to me, imploring. You don't know who you are, do you? You... Huh? It lied to me. It lied to all of the sound cuts out, but their face lingers on silent before it too fades into nothingness. Oh no. This must be Artemis, and they are clearly in need of help. I need to find a way to boost their signal. Okay. Alright, let's get up in the air a bit. Scan this then. Hollow terminus detected. Okay, we're going over there. I really need to get some more storage set up. I was just trying to organise my stuff, but I've not got enough um, storage at the moment. And I still don't know what I should keep and what I shouldn't keep. So, um, yeah, I'm always terrified to throw stuff away in case I accidentally throw something away that I could use. Or that it's worth more than I believe. So, um, yeah, I need to sort that out. Alright, I guess we're going up there. Holographic comms tower. Okay. Alright. The tower holds a powerful transmitter designed to facilitate holographic communication across long distances. The extra power should allow me to re-establish the connection to Artemis. Tune to Artemis's frequency. I tried to locate Artemis's frequency, uploading the data from our previous communication. Huh. Oh! Oh wow! Who's, who's there? You. It's you again. Isn't it? You really are real, aren't you? You aren't a dream. I am real. I'm sorry, it's hard to think here. Something's wrong with the... It's easy to create a better reality when you have to. I thought you might be a dream. I'm sorry, I haven't heard another voice in so long. Not since I cut the speaker from my ex suit. It said such terrible things. Oh no, it's crazy, dude. Ask who they are, ask what they are. Mm, let's ask who they are. The stranger smiles through the static. I'm just like you. You are a traveller of worlds, aren't you? Ask what you mean. Ask how they know. How do you know? They do not respond with speech. They transmit a vision, a red star, and a fragile world. I do not understand the shapes within the whispers. Okay. I see life forms scattered to the far reaches of the galaxies. I see this stranger's first breath yearning for the stars. I see myself slumbering in the crimson void, waiting for a dream of worlds. And through the darkness I hear it said. Breach warning. Anomaly detected. 
Huh? Designation Traveller. Awaken. What I showed you just now. It has haunted me since I woke. You must recognise it too. We are the travellers, discoverers of worlds. From the moment you open your eyes, you must have known you were not like the others. So did I. Before I came stranded here, I was on a journey to to finally meet. It cannot be a coincidence that you have found this signal. Tell me, do you still have the data log from the crashed ship? Upload data. Mention nada. Let's mention nada. Who? Please, I have to see that data. Don't toy with me. I don't have time. Okay, have it. I upload my exosuit records, including the strange transmission I received and the data I found at the crashed vessel. Much of my equipment is damaged. I am alone, on foot, stranded on the sunless world. I don't even know how your signal is reaching me, but this ship you found, it belonged to me once. Perhaps there is hope after all. We need to work out where we both are. If you build signal boosters across the system, we should be able to triangulate your position. I'll be able to find my way out and you'll get all the answers you seek. Agree with the plan. Okay. Thank you, Traveller. You're going to save my life. You're going to find me. Okay. Well, nothing else has popped up. So... Does my log say anything? No, oh, I've already. Right, okay. I've already placed one at my base, but um, it's not registered, so maybe I need to go and pick it up and put it back down. Here we go. So if I pick this back up. Use the signal base to triangulate your position. Right, triangulate position. Suitable triangulation position. Okay, pick up the signal beast uh, with. Uh, make your way to triangulation site. Triangulation process. Okay. Okay, so the second one. What's in here then? Oh, there's people in here. A place I can't pronounce observatory, Viking Preservatory. <laughs> Preservatory? Oh my god, I'm too tired to be reading. Observatory, now yeah. Does this do anything? A beacon sent long ago from a distant system waits my response. Three numbers are visible above an empty input box. I think I know what comes next. One seven o two seven o two one o two one seven. Oof. Uh, I'm too tired to think. Uh, that one. Oh no, I got it wrong. <laughs> no. Oh, what an idiot. Did I put in one that order, was already there? Oh my god, I'm so stupid. God damn it. Okay, well, I guess this is going to do the same thing. Triangulate position. Yay. Next. Oh, was there anything else now? I didn't actually look. Speak to this dude. Warrior stares at me, hostile, fiery eyes. I must look pitiful to them, baked and exhausted by the relentless sun. Nonetheless, the life form bows and greedy and traditional honor perhaps dictate it. Yes, I had to think about that. Gra, the interloper, Obdui is pathetic. The Ijuamek Viking pity you. I will begesu urg. Okay. Definitely need to learn some more of the language. <laughs> I don't feel in danger and I'm about to turn and leave when the creature points towards my multi tool. They bark with concern and my agent suggests that I should hand it over. I mean, this weren't cheap, dude. For me, I've got no money. I'm going to hand it over. Maybe it gives me something. The warrior nods in satisfaction. They take my multi tool and examine it, holding it close before tossing it away <laughs> with a 
disarray noise. What was that word? I can't pronounce things. Instead, they offer me an improved replacement multi tool. Is it they? I can't remember what mine looked like. Oh, compare. How is that an improved multi tool? Just because of its class? Oh, no. It's got a better scanner range. But, um, I wonder if. A higher class gives better things, but that's a pistol and I've got a rifle. I'm going to decline and he's going to be upset, but, um, oh, my stand increased with Ikeena. Um, yeah, I don't like that pistol, so here's what it is. Maybe I'm an idiot. Let me know down below if I, uh, should have took the pistol. I don't think I should, though. Anything down this way? Just act as keys required. I really need to get hold of them. I can't. Um, survival Bob did tell me how to get them, but I can't remember. <laughs> I'll have to check back in with him. Um. Ah, there we go. Cockpit view. Keep forgetting I can change back to it. Oh, this cockpit's cool. Oh, I can look around it. Wow, that's awesome. I didn't know I could do that. Oh wow. That is really cool. I love this this um ship. I know I'm gonna get much better ones eventually, but I'm pretty happy with this one still. Right, let's get out of here. This looks awesome when you're um jumping like this. And here we go. Oh yeah. Right, let's see if I can get this one right. I'm guessing there's gonna be another puzzle thing in here. I wonder if that um does anything different to using your uh... God damn I keep forgetting everything. What is it? <laughs> Signal booster, that's the one. Images of shattered sentinels are displayed like trophies on this terminal screen. It seems the observatory's former overseer had a per Seems the observatory's former overseer had a pension for Ponchon, Ponchon, Ponchon. That's what it is, isn't it? For hunting these machines. I think that's right, anyway. <laughs> Perhaps their time would have been better spent monitoring incoming beacons like the one that flashes on a monitor before me. If I can enter the correct access code, oh, here we go. Perhaps I can discover where it originated from. Oh, boy. Four six three four six three four four three four four six. Uh, oh man, yeah. There's always one that isn't. So I put in one that was already there on the last one. Oh, I'm so fucking dumb. There we go. The observatory comes into life as the location of a new world is displayed on the screen. I can't believe I've done that. I'm tired. Okay, honestly, that's the sort it is. Not that dumb. Actually, yeah. All right. What did it find? Oh, so it wasn't anything to do with the mission. It just locates new stuff. Okay, well, that's cool. I can check that out later. And what is this Viking going to say to me? The warrior's silent for a second before looking at me conspiratorially. I think I got that right. They check over their shoulder for prying eyes before powering down security systems. The life form pulls open a hidden vault at their feet, which seems to be piled high with Starship upgrade modules. Oh boy, come on, give me something good. Contraband in Sloper. Itanglich. Um. Umsil Sunguian. Agbasha. Ormanium and Zichin. Exusa? <laughs> Fanka Gilantumbiant. Mm. I'm sure I nail all of these alien languages. I'm just going to let you know that. I think that's right. I pause considering the offer. All I hear is... What offer? I don't even know what he said. <laughs> all I hear is the soft muted sound of the desert wind outside. Is this a trap? A test? The warrior indicates a willingness to trade. Offer units, 100 units. Offer metal, 75 pure ferrite. Threaten to report. <laughs> Let's go, dude. You can have 100 units. Why not? 
The Warriors check that had disappointing units are presumably traceable by the authorities. Ah, oh, I go to make another offer, but they appear to have decided I'm too much of a risk. Oh no! Ah, Ensign Jaya Dingmi closes the vault. I think I got his name right. Whatever, man. God damn. Oh. Oh, well, come on. Let's get his booster down. Triangulate. Okay, return to space to contact Artemis. Oh, cool. Oh, what are them little creatures? These new ones. Have I not seen these yet? Oh, no, I have seen these. They look like something off of uh, Plants for Zombies. <laughs> oh, man, I love these little creatures on this game. Oh, and that just looks like a weird jumping maggot. Right, let's go. Here he is. Well, she is. I don't know whether it's a boy or a girl, Artemis. There's a character on Smite that's Artemis, which is a ancient god, and that's a girl, so... Or maybe it's a unisex name, I don't know. When I first reached out to the heavens, I had no idea what to expect. The beauty, the mystery, the adventure, the danger. And here we are, aren't we? Go to Hollow Terminus, upload your data, let's find each other. What is this, a dating app? What's going on? Oh boy, coming in hot. Sorted. Oh yeah. Alright, okay. Holographic comms tower. Okay, here we go. Have you triangulated your position? Let me know when you're ready to receive some data. Confirm. Excellent. We're really getting somewhere. Hold on. I'll just... Artemis transmits some data of their own, a star chart showing the skies around their location. I don't have any equipment, I don't know where I am, I don't even know how long I've been here. So, I've taken an old fashioned approach, I've sketched the stars. Oh, I hope he's a good artist. If you visit a space station, you should find plenty of locals able to match our star patterns. My ship was nearby, so we can't be far apart. I'll patch my translator through so that you can understand what they're saying. You'll need to calibrate it first, but that should only take a few words. End communication. Good luck, or maybe see you soon. Sorted, okay. Need technology discovered, Artemis translator. Okay, I need some copper. Brilliant, there ain't got any with me. Got no copper with me. Is there any here, or am I going to have to fly back? Oh, there's some. Right, let's head over there and then grab that. Right. Oh, perfect. It's only going to pick up copper. <laughs> That'll do then. There you go. Right, okay, so that's that done. Um, speak with aliens board space stations to learn their dialect, learn words from ancient ruins and historical sites, install an auto translator in the exosuit to translate conversations. Okay, so I've got a, um, a uh, translator already. Nooch, uh, no, that's not it. Where is it? <laughs> Simple translator. So, which is the same as this one. So, I wonder if I need the other one or not. I'll, I'll keep them both for now, but in case I lose the Artemis one afterwards. Right, but we need to go to a station. Oh, inhabited outpost detected. I don't know if I could just go to the anomaly or another space station, speak to people. But um, I'll just follow the the mission marker and see what happens. Oh, the space anomaly. Bring news of Narda to the space anomaly. Okay. 
don't know if this is a bad thing or not, or whether I have a choice, but we'll go there. Alright, here we go. Nada saw a signal, traveller friend. Do you connect with Artemis entity? Tell Nada about Artemis. Artemis friend wishes to meet other travellers, but they have... It seems Artemis friend has forgotten Nada. Curious. It is good to help this entity, traveller friend, but Nada advises caution. Ask who Artemis is. Artemis entity was is a traveller entity. One like you, Nada had made them safe. They were known to Nada. This entity may be Artemis entity, but a different iteration. Another way for Artemis entity to be. All fraud. <laughs> the universe does not like our little home. We do not acknowledge their rules, and they would punish us. Okay, speak with Polo and other life forms. Okay, where's Polo? Nada friend guides lost anomalies to our home, makes us safe and becomes a hunter. Nada is great friend indeed. Ask about Artemis. Perhaps Artemis friend has forgotten us. That would be sad. Or I will think that Artemis friend has travelled somewhere when they have not met us yet. Ask for Atlas coordinates. Polo nods serious. They send coordinates there for an Atlas station to my starship. What's an Atlas station then? Black holes? Polar smells and sends a location of a black hole to my starship navigation computer. Okay. I guess you can just keep asking for them then. Okay, alright, so people I'm speaking to here aren't counting towards um, my calibration. Oh, is this a trading post? Any good? Nah. It's got funny, I don't know. Law interloper. Zix is Guru Muk. Anti interloping. Zian. All will. Iku. Peace. No idea. Uh, help. I submit my request nervously, but warrior. A pot adopts a gentle posture for one so intimidating. They teach me a word of their language and bow with respect. As I turn to leave, Warrior Pot barks and stop me. They must have appreciated my interest in their history as they thrust me a chart with directions to an ancient relic. Okay, I won't want to speak anymore, so hoping he'd let me practice. Oh, I've got 33% calibration. Okay, we're at an ancient ruin on the um, back on another planet. See if we get anything from this. A couple of stones here. Got of. Not. I learnt warrior um, before I left the other planet. It didn't seem to give me any um, percentage increase anymore. Ooh, large outpost detected. The imprint of an alien civilization was once absorbed by this strange marker. The story of the Vikings somehow spills out in a language of my own people. The naval travellers will be spared. Their journey through the cosmos shall not be thwarted. So it is decreed. The will of her commands it. The High Keen shall honour the judgement and the belief of the ancients. Seek help with language. Seek knowledge of the past. Help with language. My knowledge of the Viking increases. Uh, learn in. Ah, cool. This is a cool little outpost. Warrior Lahuring. Lahuring? Grind labour. Such little honour. Viking are unimpressed. Though the garble of art must translate it, it is clear that I am yet to make an impact on the Viking. I need to improve my reputation rank. Oh, okay, got to get some rep grind on the go. Raise your standing Viking by uh, by two. Raise standing at mission boards and space stations. All missions performed at the mission board will raise your standing. 
All right, cool then. Well, I wanted to go and find Artemis, but it looks like um, I'm on a mission to do a load of missions now then. So, um, yeah, I'll get on and grind some of them out and see what happens. I'm actually really enjoying the um, following this mission line. Um, and from the sounds of it, it goes on quite far into the game or it just never ends. I'm not too sure, but um, I guess you guys can let me know down below. But um, I'm really enjoying it so far. Um, I haven't played like a story-driven game for quite some time, and um, I do miss them. So this is a nice little change while keeping the survival aspects and the building aspects of the games that I love, like Atlas and Ark. So yeah, really enjoying it. Hopefully in the next one we will find Artemis then, and find out what the hell is actually going on. And um, maybe get to a few more systems. I really want that giant ship that I can never remember the name of. Uh, is it a freighter? I think it's a freighter, right? So, uh, yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.